Hello there everyone, I am the Random Gamer, and I, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use Dark Basic Professional Editor. It's basically a game programming system that I use, and many others use in fact, and it's very much, it's more easy for me to use than other programs I've used, such as HTML or Java, and it just depends on how well you are at coding, but today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the Dark Basic Professional Editor. So first to make anything on here, you wanna turn your sync on. And then you wanna set your sync rate to say 60. That way people who have bad computers run at the same speed as people ha who have good computers and it keeps the game running okay. And then you're going to want to create a display mode. I usually use my, give me a second, I forgot this, something in. You want to type in set, display, mode, and then I usually use 800 by 600, and then you type in 32 at the end. And after that, you want to turn on AutoCam. That way it sets a camera automatically on your game. Next, what we want to do is we want to say, turn on backdrop. So I want to type in backdrop on. That's basically the layout of the map. Now I want to type in make object. Just to start off as my first player. And to make an object, you want to type in the make object and then space and the ID and the size of your object. I usually use 50 as my size. And I forgot to add cube, but you can basically use any shape you want. And for this example, I'll be using a cube. And this is in 3D, by the way, too, when you load it. It's automatically set as that. So now that I have a cube set up, now I want to set a do loop. So what a do loop does is it basically, give me a second. A do loop, it controls or repeats really. It repeats a command over and over again, unless stated not to do so. So what I'm going to put in here is sync. That way it keeps refreshing the screen automatically. So now I'm going to go under compile and run. And there I go, I have my basic of the game set up. Now, that's just a cube that's been put on the screen and everything. And I will be, going, I will be showing you guys how to do controls and such for the cube in my next video, and I hope you guys enjoy this one. But I have... <coughs> Sorry about that. I'm a little sick. But... <laughs> I'll be better soon. I'm taking a little bit of medicine for that. But, so now I'm going to show you guys how to actually... <coughs> Sorry guys, I think I'm going to have to cut this video short today, but this is basically how you set up the basic layout for the beginning of the game, such as the backdrop and then make objects and the do it. And I will make my next video very soon, and I will see you guys next time.